And give good tidings to those who believe and do righteous deeds, that they will have gardens in paradise beneath which rivers flow. Whenever they are provided with a provision of fruit therefrom, they will say, This is what we were provided with before, and it is given to them in likeness, and they will have therein purified spouses, and they will abide therein eternally. It is he who created for you all of that which is on the earth. Then he directed himself to the heaven, his being above all creation, and made them seven heavens, and he is knowing of all things. Indeed, in the creation of the heavens and the earth, and the alternation of the night and the day, and the great ships which sail through the sea with that which benefits people, and what Allah has sent down from the heavens of rain, giving life thereby to the earth after its lifelessness and dispersing therein every kind of moving creature, and his directing of the winds and the clouds controlled between the heaven and earth are signs for a people who use reason. Say, shall I inform you of something better than that? For those who fear Allah will be gardens in the presence of their Lord, beneath which rivers flow, wherein they abide eternally, and purified spouses, and approval from Allah. And Allah is seeing of his servants. To Allah belongs whatever is in the heavens and whatever is on the earth. He forgives whom he wills and punishes whom he wills. And Allah is forgiving and merciful. Those Their reward is forgiveness from their Lord and gardens beneath which rivers flow in paradise, wherein they will abide eternally, and excellent is the reward of the righteous workers. Allah has certainly heard the statement of those Jews who said, Indeed, Allah is poor while we are rich. We will record what they said and their killing of the prophets without right, and will say, Taste the punishment of the burning fire. And their Lord responded to them, Never will I allow to be lost the work of any worker among you, whether male or female. You are of one another. So those who emigrated or were evicted from their homes or were harmed in my cause or fought or were killed, I will surely remove from them their misdeeds, and I will surely admit them to gardens beneath which rivers flow as reward from Allah and Allah has with him the best reward. But those who feared their Lord will have gardens beneath which rivers flow, abiding eternally therein as accommodation from Allah. And that which is with Allah is best for the righteous. And it is he who created the heavens and earth in truth. And the day he says, Be, and it is, his word is the truth and his is the dominion on the day the horn is blown. He is knower of the unseen and the witnessed, and he is the wise, the acquainted. He is originator of the heavens and the earth. How could he have a son when he does not have a companion? And he created all things, and he is of all things knowing. Seven heavens and the earth and whatever is in them exalt him. And there is not a thing except that it exalts Allah by his praise. But you do not understand their way of exalting. Indeed, he is ever forbearing and forgiving. And those who believed and whose descendants followed them in faith, we will join with them their descendants, and we will not deprive them of anything of their deeds. Every person, for what he earned, is retained. So which of the favors of your Lord would you deny? In them are women limiting their glances, untouched before them by man or genie, fair ones reserved in pavilions. So which of the favors of your Lord would you deny? Untouched before them by man or genie, will circulate among them young boys made eternal, and for them are fair women with large beautiful eyes, and made them virgins. It is Allah who has created seven heavens and of the earth the like of them. His command descends among them so you may know that Allah is over all things competent, 
and that Allah has encompassed all things in knowledge, and who created seven heavens in layers. You do not see in the creation of the Most Merciful any inconsistency. So return your vision to the sky. Do you see any breaks? Do you not consider how Allah has created seven heavens in layers? And we have sought to reach the heaven, but found it filled with powerful guards and burning flames. There will circulate among them young boys made eternal. When you see them, you would think them as beautiful as scattered pearls. Instructed above you seven strong heavens, 